Hey, what's up, everybody? Uh, back again, solving problems, problem solver channel. Uh, we got some more dog bite damage uh, right where the seatbelt's at. At first, I looked at it and was like, I don't know if there's anything we can do about that today, but then I came up with an idea, something I've done before. Let's go check it out, show you what to do. Okay, this is on a 2016 Toyota Highlander and the fabric in the pocket for the seatbelt receptacle is destroyed. Assumably from a dog. So, trying to solve this quickly so it doesn't cost a bunch of money for the customer. Show you what I'm gonna do. All right, I've got my stitch kit here. Where I keep a bunch of needle and thread that I use frequently. This material is just shredded. I'm just gonna, I'm actually gonna trim a chunk off. That should be okay, but I just don't want it in my way, so there goes that. All right, I'm gonna use my beaver, is what they call this color. Thread I got from the upholstery shop. I will leave uh, links in the description below where it says show more for uh, everything I'm using here. So you can do something like this yourself. I'm gonna go ahead and measure my thread out, how much I need, and then I like to double that in case I have something go wrong and I need more. Then I'm gonna get me some curved needles that you can find on Amazon or the craft store, like I said. Most of the stuff you can find online and get it shipped right away. And then it's affordable. I melt my ends so I can feed them easier through the eye of the needle. And I think I'll go ahead and do a double needle on this. Okay. I'm going to get my, this is what I've got handy, so this is what I'm going to use. This is like a speaker box, subwoofer speaker box carpeting or trunk carpeting. It's real, it's real thin as far as carpeting goes. I'm going to cut out a piece and I'm just going to run it from here to there uh, of this material. I'm going to hand stitch it and then I'll just tuck it in and it'll be Ready to, ready to roll, ready to back into service. Uh, let's see. So I want something like this. Actually, it's gonna be like this. No, it will be like that. No. Let me stitch down like that and fold it inward, okay. Lay it out and see how much I need. Cut a little extra, be safe. And it needs to be a few inches deep, so I'm going to go ahead and cut a little extra there as well to be safe.
we go. Now I'm just gonna follow right where they were stitching, the uh, factory stitching was. And if you're worried about this coming loose and unraveling, you can put a little, a little drop of super glue right here on the edge, and that will keep that from happening. <clears throat> It'll go a long way as far as keeping the threads in place. So, let's see here. Make sure it fits after cutting it. Oh yeah, I got plenty. All right. And the reason I'm only running it from here to there is because that's all I'm gonna need. It's a little bit awkward. Hand stitching is always an awkward affair. But we'll get through it. In fact, switch places with the camera. Alright. I should say stitching in a seat and while it's mounted in a car is always different. Awkward. I kind of messed that up. That's all right. Hey, I'm making this up as I go, so I guess there's only, there's no wrong way to do it. This tight and just see what it looks like. That'll work. I'm gonna try to keep this. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Like I said, I remember doing this once before. Uh, I don't know what's going on here, but it's not wanting to... Having the double needle, double thread, I'm able to pull tight from both ends to make sure I get a nice, nice look. In case you're wondering why I've got such a long tail and I didn't tie it off. I don't want to break my thread, but I, do, I don't want to leave it too loose. There's 
be careful when you're each movement that you're not tangling your thread against itself or tying it in a knot because that's that's what really slows you down when doing something like this is getting in a hurry and making a mistake and then going back and having to re take threads out and redo it and breaking a needle so you have to go get another one and re-thread it breaking your thread so you have to tie it you know take some out tie it off and start again and that all takes time it's just like with the sewing machine it's all pretty simple but every time you break your thread or your needle or it just slows you down so much it's kind of hard to believe how much now I'm stitching right into the leather these needles get hard to pull I've got some pretty tough hands but if they get hard to pull uh, I'll get pliers out and I'll start using the pliers to feed it through because you can't put too much leverage on these things they snap With the pliers you can get a hold of it and and pull it real hard like that but not with your fingers it's nice sometimes see that's a split right there where I put the needle through my thread that'll really mess you up if you don't catch it Looking pretty good. Once again, I kind of had a hunch it would. Because, well, I do this for a living and I want to get paid. And if I want to get paid, I gotta complete the job. If I want to get paid the couple bucks. You know, if I didn't leave extra material and it had kind of bunched up and it come up a little short, and then you'd be mad. Of course, this stuff you can stretch a little bit. And it's got some forgiveness for mistakes, if you will. My thread sure feels short, though. Wish I'd have made that longer. come around get in here like a contortionist and finish this off everybody can go back to what they were doing before or you can go back to trying this on your own car whatever it is whatever it is you got going today
Because my kids have been asking for Christmas presents ever since, every single day since Christmas, they're asking me for something new. Like they just thought it became a way of life <clears throat> to open new boxes of stuff every day. I don't know what they're thinking. Of course, some of these YouTubers, I guess that is the way of life. They probably don't know how to get, they probably have issues getting rid of all the cardboard boxes. All this stuff they review and get sent for free and. I'm gonna go ahead and do another stitch just to be nice. But I'm running out of threads, so that's I gotta end it. <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and use this right here. For this purpose. said about the awkward affair there's always some heavy breathing and poke your finger but you know what it's a lot, I feel a lot better about this than giving it back saying well I could fix some of the stuff you asked me about but not everything and of course they probably won't even say anything they, this customer, they just expect me to have a magic wand and wizard things out. This is what happens if you wizard things out too many times for somebody. They're not so impressed after a while. But they do thank me with a paycheck and that is all I need. All right, moment of truth. Let's see how she goes. I'm gonna have to trim it a little bit. Because it seems a little bit long. Double check your uh, Toyota Highlander next time you're buying one. It might be this one. Now I'm going to hide my thread by tucking it in where it came out. Give it a little pop, a little pull, and it sucks right in. Another job done. Look at that. And, the, and the, looking through the, the camera here, these pop out quite a bit. Uh, but it's, you know, this camera, it's amazing. It works so well, it makes things look worse than they do in, to the eye. But in any case, fluff it around or do whatever you want to do to make it like I, they're not even like I said they're not even gonna say anything they just they're like thanks yeah so there you go dog bite 
upholstery ripped seat belt receptacle pocket. How about that for a title? Oh, got it done. Hunched over. What you gotta do, what you gotta do. All right, you guys, thanks for checking out my channel. Thanks for staying till the end. Hit the thumbs up and subscribe if you've never seen that done before. And if that helped you out, I really appreciate it. Catch you back here again later.